Hi there. The disk unknown not initialized error is a common disk issue on Windows PCs, which usually occurs on external hard drives. The error can occur for many reasons, such as disk not initialized, corrupted MBR, outdated or corrupted drivers, and so on. Based on these causes, we provide four fixes for you in this video. But before these fixes, you can change to another USB port first. If the error still exists, turn to the following fixes. The first way is to initialize the disk to fix disk 1 unknown not initialized error. First, navigate to Ease Us Partition Master Official website. It's an easy to use initialize tool for even beginners. Download this tool by clicking the free trial button here or from the description below this video. Well, let's see how to use Ease Us Partition Master to initialize the not initialized disk. Open Ease Us Partition Master and navigate to the Partition Manager section. Right-click the target disk, select Initialize to MBR or GPT. Here, I use GPT as an example. Then, click Execute one task at the bottom right. Click Apply to start. After this, your disk will be initialized to MBR or GPT. This may remove the disk 1 unknown, not initialized error. The second fix is to rebuild MBR. To rebuild MBR, we need to type commands in the command prompt, so be careful when following these steps in case of any data loss. Before we start, make sure you have connected an installation USB to your PC. Then, move to the Install screen and select Repair your computer. Click Troubleshoot and Command Prompt. A command prompt window will appear. Input bootrec space slash fix MBR and press Enter. Then, Type bootrec space slash fixboot and enter again. Next, type bootrec space slash scan OS and enter to continue. Type bootrec space slash rebuild BCD and hit the enter key. Finally, exit command prompt, reject the recovery USB and restart your PC to see if the error exists. The third solution is to check and fix hard disk errors. There are two options to check disk errors. Using EaseUS Partition Master, or using command prompt. It suggested beginners use EaseUS Partition Master since it's safer and easier. Well, let's start with the easier one. Open EaseUS Partition Master and navigate to Partition Manager section. Right-click the target partition that has a problem. Choose Advanced and then Check File System. Next, check the Try to Fix Errors if Found option in the Check File System window. Finally, click Start. This will check and repair the possible error on your disk. You can also use Command Prompt to check the disk, but it is a little difficult. First, search Command Prompt in the Windows search box and run CMD as administrator. Type C H K D S K space E colon slash R A space slash F and hit the Enter key. You need to replace E with the target partition number. This command will take some time to examine your disk. The fourth solution is to update the disk driver. First, right-click the Start button and select Device Manager here. In Device Manager, click Disk Drives and right-click the target derv suffering from errors. Select Update Drivers. Click Search automatically for driver. If the current driver is outdated, you can follow the on-screen prompts to update. These are four solutions for a disk one unknown not initialized error. Hope they can remove your problem. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel to get more tutorials.